welcome back to another episode of Balling With. Today, guys, we're going to hop right on into the Buffalo Bills over or under schedule this season. Uh, they are marked at 10 and a half on the FanDuel Sportsbook. Um, you know, they've been winning pretty much uh, the past couple of seasons. This is the season I think they could go all the way. Who knows? Um, the Buffalo Bills are a pretty great team, and they're starting off a week one hot with the New York Jets, Aaron Rodgers led team. Uh, I do think the Buffalo Bills will win this Monday night game. Um, just because the Jets are still, you know, fine in there. So they're gonna get on the roll though, but I do think the Buffalo Bills will win week one, just coming off hot. Uh and I've seen a stat wise that new quarterbacks coming to new teams usually typically lose their first game and it's gonna be a nail biter. Not a nail biter, but a, a tough matchup for them. Uh are they gonna beat the Las Vegas Raiders? Um, I do think Buffalo Bills become 0-2, I mean, 2-0 and here, uh, and they will be 3-0. and I do think they're going to beat my team. Commanders probably will have a, uh, probably compete a little bit, but the Buffalo Bills are just too good. We won't really see how their offense is, uh, changed within the next, from the last two years. Um, I think they still have Gabe Davis. I'm not quite sure, but they did draft the tight end, Kincaid, um, and Josh Allen's still going to run. He's still going to be making those plays. Their defense is still stout, um, so I do think Commanders will lose. So they're going to be three and zero. This is going to be a tough, tough matchup, division matchup as well. Um, and they could split. Dolphins could split their wins for every team with these three teams with the Jets and Bills. Bills can split them, and the Jets can all split them. So it's going to be a tough division race as well for those three teams. Uh, and it's a good division. Uh, I do think Dolphins will get them here. Uh, to a uh, Waddle, Tyreek Hill, uh, and Today, they're still looking to try to acquire uh, Jonathan Taylor. So, they get that. They still have Mostert, uh, and their defense is pretty good. Jalen Ramsey is injured, though, but they still have Howard on the other side. Um, so, I do think they lose here. So, that is 3-1. It's going to be another tough uh, playoff potential matchup here for the Jags. Um, I think they could win this game as well if they, you know, shock some people. I do think the Bills will win. Um, it's going to be a close matchup, though. Uh, Ter- Trevor Lawrence has had to get up over that hump. But I don't know. Well, that's gonna be a, a, a up in the air one. So let's say, let's say they lose this one, just just for the sake of it. So one, two, three, four, five. They lost two in a row. So three and two. It's gonna be another close matchup for the Giants. The Bills is gonna be a close matchup for them. Um, I do think the Bills carry uh, this one away as well towards the end of the game. Uh, so I leave them four and two. Uh, they're going to be five and two versus the New England Patriots, six and two versus the Buccaneers. Depends when Joe Barrow comes back. If Joe Barrow comes back, I do think he should be back around November fifth. Uh, let's say he did come back this game. This is a, a prime time matchup. Uh, I do think Bengals will win. So let's say, uh, I think six and three here, seven and three. Let's say seven and four. Let's say seven and five. Seven and six. Buffalo Bills might go on a little losing streak, guys. Cowboys they're gonna win this seven and or eight and eight and five. And another close matchup. Could they could lose this game? It really depends. I do think that the league will be closer this year. I don't think anyone's gonna really have over 12, 13 wins. Um it's gonna be a lot of close games. Uh, I do think they're gonna lose this game here. So let's say I lost track of what the record was. Um and they have them losing these two games, these three games here. Uh, eight and five, I think it was eight and they're gonna lose this. So nine and eight and something. I'm gonna keep doing it, but uh, I think they lose. They should lose this game versus the Chargers. Depends how the Chargers play. Um, there's gonna be a close matchup as well. They're gonna win this game, and I do think they're gonna win this game off the back end versus the Dolphins. I don't know if that was eleven or ten wins. I do think it was 10, and I would put them under under 11 wins. I think they're going to hit 10 wins on the dot. I do have the Ravens doing that, the same thing as well. They're right on that nose. Uh, both of them are going to be right on that nose. Of, uh, and Are they both going to win over that 11th or 10th, 11th win or going to be right on that 10th? Uh, I do think the Bills are going to be right on that 10th, but still make the playoffs some way, somehow. Um, and with that being said, guys, make sure you like, comment, subscribe on this video. Buffalo Bills, we already know they're a no-brainer team that's going to be in the playoffs. They've been in the playoffs multiple times, uh, and it's about how they play this year in the playoffs because this is, you know, their time is ticking. A lot of people say their time is ticking. They got about 
this season left next season, and then they're going to probably start into dismantle that roster. Um, and then they've been, you know, the last three, four seasons, they've been in the uh, playoff contentions. Um, but the um, Kansas City Chiefs, look out for them. Uh, guys, with that being said, like, comment, subscribe on this video. We got a slew of more uh, teams to look at their over and unders. Um, comment, like, subscribe on this video. What you guys think about the Buffalo Bills? Will they win the Super Bowl? Will they win over 11 games? Uh, who knows? Only time will tell. Uh, make sure you catch you guys on the next one. But make sure you like, comment, subscribe to build this channel up. We got more media highlights, bets, challenges, um, videos like this coming as well. Guys, catch you on the next episode.